I would wait until like the last week to make that decision. Because a lot could happen between now and the October test, right? And the problem is you have to sign up before you know you're really ready. Unfortunately, the way they have it set up, it's like you have to kind of, you have to kind of guess. You have to like say, well, okay, th there's a possibility I could be ready in a month or two months, so I'm gonna sign up now. Right. And then if I'm not ready, then I withdraw, but you don't make that decision until the last week. Unless it's like obvious, but um, I don't know. Sometimes things can come together faster than we think. Sometimes it takes longer. It's, it sucks because you lose the money if you withdraw, but I, you know, the alternative is to, to get ready and then now have to kind of wait two months until you can take it. But I would keep the November registration deadline in your calendar because before the day before that or the, the week before that you want to start thinking do I have a chance at getting it by November and if you have a decent chance you, need it. you know you could you've seen your progress up to this point and you could see oh maybe I can make the same progress between now and November I could be ready then you sign up you may end up withdrawing but at least then you can kind of like time it so that when you hit that range you're also then going to go take it don't stress too much though. The most important thing is to improve your score. Practice the scores with practice, good solid practice. And then, you know, if you end up having to take a later test like January, oh well, so what? Like, at least you got the score eventually.